Hi everyone, I'm Adam from Audience and this is Aurea. This is our new baby and this is the world's first Atmos immersive audio interface and monitor controller. We are super proud of it. There are solutions out there that do this kind of. So we designed this from the ground up to be dedicated to immersive mixing. So it's got lots of features like the calibration is on board. So each speaker has its own eight band EQ section and a level trim and a time delay if you need it, if some of your speakers aren't in perfect places. Uh, bass management, so if you've got some speakers in the array that can't do super low bass, it sends that to your subwoofer. All on board, nice and easy. It also has two stereo outputs so that you can switch your favorite near fields or whatever you want to use with one button, nice and simple, easy. The software is super intuitive, so we've got separate individual mutes and solos for groups, channels. We've got the thing called profiles where we can switch between different EQ profiles for say the whole thing and it also switches the speakers at the same time. You can use this as a standalone USB-C interface if you've got something like an Atmos mix room and you'd want to keep it clean and simple. In that case, you also have two of our console preamps inbuilt. So if you do want to have, say, a last minute vocal session, you're not struggling to add extra hardware in, it's just there. And it's the same preamps from our console, which is over there behind me. The other reason that we included the two microphone preamps is because it comes with one of these in every box. This is the Sound ID reference microphone from Sonarworks. And the reason we put that in there is not just because we're feeling generous, it's because you can capture a full immersive setup with the Sound ID software and export that as an EQ profile straight into Aurea. So that is then completely configured without you having to be a professional acoustician or having to hire an acoustician and pay crazy amounts of money. It's just easy. And that's all in there. We've tried to make everything as easy as possible because Atmos, it's not simple. It's not easy. It's a complicated subject. And so we tried to get everything out of your way, but still doing the best job that it can. And so there are things, little details like the AES outputs here, which can feed digital speakers if they've already got digital outputs, which is freely configurable. So you don't have to crisscross AES cables across your studio. You can just run them nice and neat because we all like a bit of neatness. There's the option of a Dante card. If you work a realm like post-production, you can add a 16 channel input Dante card in here. Um, the ADAT inputs, if you're using this as a USB interface, can be used as expansion. But my favorite thing that I use in my studio is I flip it round and use the ADATs as the pass through for the calibration in the speakers. So it becomes a full monitor controller in that circumstance. In my studio, I've got 36 in, 36 out system with lots of ADATs and I feed the two ADAT outputs to here and then feed the Dolby Atmos renderers output to here. And that means I didn't have to remove my existing studio setup. And then I could just add to that. So if one day I'm a tracking studio and the next day I'm an Atmos mixer, I can do that all in one without sacrificing anything and still have the configuration nice and easy, preset and profiles, maybe take me half a day to do all of that with all my speakers and then I'm done forever. It's all hosted on the hardware. There's a separate iPad app. So if this is in the rack further away from you, you don't have to break your back. You can use the iPad app to control everything nice and easy. There's dedicated headphone outputs so that if you want to send the binaural mix separate or an artist cue mix, that's all in there too. We've really tried to cover every base of all the things that immersive mixers are going to need and not add stuff that you really don't. This is available Q1 this year. So within probably the next four to six weeks, they are £2,550 in the UK, $26, $25 in the US. And we really, really can't wait to see what you guys are going to do with these. Thanks for watching. See you soon.